This is why we chose to live in a school bus. We actually used to live in an apartment. We did. We had a stick and bricks, just like the rest of you guys. But we really liked going to music festivals and vending at the festivals. And we found that every time we started at our apartment and went to a festival, we'd always have to come back to our apartment. Or if we traveled, then we couldn't go too far because we always had to come back to that point A. We decided to look into living on the road. And that's when the idea of a van or a short bus came into mind. But then we decided if we're going to not come back to point A, let's just get rid of point A and let's move 100% into a bus. We found that if we got rid of that, then we would have enough money to travel and live on the road. Then the small bus became bigger. So we looked at a few RVs, but decided that having just the standard layout was not going to work for us. We were artists and we travel with our studios with us and also a full store. So we needed something bigger and with better storage. And something that was customizable so that it would make sense. A couple of bunk beds and a second bathroom weren't really needed for us. So we decided the custom built school bus was the way for us. And the funny thing is, right after we decided this, we actually found the bus about maybe three miles from where we are currently staying at that time. We were on a camping trip going um, up and down the East Coast and happened to be in Florida. So we found a Florida bus with no rust and a great engine and tranny combo. So it was, it seemed like everything aligned right for us. So we kind of had to do it. We felt kind of weird about it because it was the first bus we looked at, but it worked out and here she is. We did the bus, we fixed it up, moved out of our apartment when we were supposed to, and hit the road for our first festival. Five years ago, if you told me that I'd be living in a school bus traveling around the country, I would have laughed in your face and said, no way. But we realized that we really, really love this lifestyle and honestly have no plans of returning to a stick and bricks. It's just too darn expensive. So make sure you give us a follow. And we'll see you down the road.